who's, who's ready? Who's ready? All right, let's go through the alphabet. So what have we, what have we done so far? Eating the alphabet one letter at a time. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I. Oh good, Caitlin, thanks for hanging on with me. Letter I today. I am so excited about this one. I can barely stand it. Okay, so let's go through. Uh, first of all, uh, let's think of some things that start with I. Uh, icicle makes an I sound. Um, ice cream. Guess what we're making today? Ice cream. Okay, so let's go through our, um, you gotta wash your hands, I just washed my hands, I'm gonna roll up my sleeves and get ready. All right, let's go through our ingredients. We needed a frozen banana cut up into chunks. Oh, inchworm, right. Um, so I took a banana last night and I peeled it and I cut it into chunks and then I put it in the freezer and listen, it's very, it's hard as a rock, okay? One banana. Then we need cocoa powder, which is like chocolate powder. And you cook, you bake with it, and it doesn't taste sweet. It just tastes kind of chocolatey, but not really sweet, kind of bitter. And then you need a little teeny tiny bit of vanilla, which is one of my favorite ingredients because it smells so delicious. Put your nose up to there, can you smell it? <laughs> Grown-ups, have your, have your kids um, smell smell the vanilla because that's um, such a good sensory experience. What else? Okay, then little things that you want to add on to your uh, bananas, if uh, your uh, ice cream. So it's going to be banana ice cream. I'm not a big banana ice cream fan, but let me tell you, this is delicious and you don't need any sugar because the bananas are so sweet. So you can make a banana chocolate chip ice cream because do I make chocolate? Do I put chocolate chips in almost everything? Yes, Miss Betty, I do. I also thought um, maybe some coconut. Um, if you like, some people like um, banana peanut butter ice cream. I'm just gonna do chocolate chips. Okay, so I'm gonna put them in my little. I'm gonna put the bananas in my little chopper. You can do it in a blender, but look at this chopper. It's the size of my hand. It's so tiny. Now I'm going to put it in, and it's going to make such a loud noise. I'm going to wake up everybody in my house. Okay, so I'm going to take my, I'm going to take my ice, my banana, frozen banana chunks. I'm going to throw them in here. I'm going to put the top on. Cover your ears because it's really loud. Mushing around. It takes a long time because they're like frozen ice cubes. Oh, it's getting mushy on the bottom. Oh, it's getting icy. It's getting mushy. It's so stuck. Now, sometimes you might need to put a little teeny tiny bit of liquid in. So I'm just going to, I have almond milk. I'm going to put just a tiny bit in to get it moving a little bit. Smush those bananas in. Big chunks. <laughs> Oh, it's looking so ice creamy. I have to show you this because there's, so, there's steps to how it's looking. So see, I have some really creamy ice cream here, and here I still have chunks. So I'm going to work on those chunks. I'll be working all day on those chunks, I think. Mush them down. 
think this will do it. Or not. I think I'm going to put a little more liquid in. Just a tiny bit because I want it to taste really like bananas, not milk. Give it another stir. like real ice cream. Look at this spoon. Where's my spoon? It's like real ice cream. And now I'm going to put it in my, I'm going to put it in this bowl because now I have to put my fun additions in it. I'm going to put my chocolate chips to be really careful because this is sharp. Oh, this is coming out better than it did when I did a practice one for Mr. Betty yesterday. All right. So, here's my ice cream. I'm going to throw some chocolate chips in it. And I'm going to stir that up. Now, I'm going to eat it. All right, ready? That's it. Oh, I forgot the vanilla. That's not really important, but you know what? I'll throw a little tiny bit in. So tiny. One little drop. Watch. Whoa. That was too many drops. All right, mix it up. Look at it. it looks just like ice cream. Oh, but you know what I thought I would do? I forgot to put the cocoa in. You guys, I had such technical problems today. I'm all, I'm all out of whack. Did you see my dog? Hey, Tegan. So, all right, so I'm going to, I'm putting it back in there because I'm going to make this chocolate. This is live. I need an assistant. And it, it's got to be somebody more than the dog. All right, I'm putting it back in. So I'm putting the chocolate in. All right. One tablespoon of the chocolate powder. <sighs> now let's get going here, Miss Betty. Oh, there we go. Now we're talking. And I'm going to put it in my fancy ice cream sundae glass so that when I eat it in front of you, I'm going to look all fancy schmancy. So if you have a fancy, a fancy glass, you need to put this in your fancy glass because you're going to feel fancy when you're eating it. Oh my gosh. You guys need to come over here right now and eat this with me. I have so much. I'm having ice cream for breakfast. Okay, so I have my chocolate chips. I have my chocolate cocoa powder and I have my frozen bananas. All right, let's see if I make it. Her face that means it didn't go well. Oh. You don't even really taste the banana. It's chocolatey. It's icy cold. Mmm. So good. So good. I think this might be one of my favorites. It needs a little whipped cream. And um you gotta make it and you gotta tell me how it comes out. So good. Okay. I'm getting a brain freeze. Okay, who's ready? Let's practice. Letter I is so easy peasy. You don't even, you won't even believe it. You got your paper? Brett, you ready? Brett's my buddy. He's doing this letter every week. And they send me pictures and it makes my heart want to burst. Letter I, here it is. It's just a line. Ready? We start up here. Ta-da! I'm done. I can start my day. I did my letter I. All right, let's do it again. 
Is this the easiest letter? Ta-da! Now, sometimes you'll see it in a book, and it's got a little top to it and a little bottom, so you could do it either way. Letter I. I is for ice cream. Can I eat my ice cream breakfast? I'm so glad I remembered to put the chocolate in. It's a game changer. Now, I bet you could put, try this, if you don't like, um, if you don't like uh, chocolate. Well, first of all, you must be crazy. But a frozen banana, or put in, no, put in just a regular banana and put in some frozen fruit. If you have frozen fruit in your freezer, um, throw that in. And I bet you, you'll make, if you have frozen blueberries, you can make blueberry ice cream. If you have frozen strawberries, you can make strawberry ice cream. I think I have a bag of um, frozen mangoes and peaches. Oh my goodness. The possibilities are endless. So, I will see you next week. What's next week? Well, let's, let's sing our song I figure it out. A you singing with me? A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J. J next week. Don't want to miss it. It's a delicious one. Everybody say, everybody say goodbye to my dog, Finny. He's waiting for some he's waiting for some ice cream scraps, but I am not gonna drop anything because I'm gonna eat this entire thing. Mm. I am the best ice cream maker in the world. Make it. You can be the best ice cream maker too. Letter I. See you next week for letter J. Happy snacking, everybody.